your minds to broken hearts I went home my life without you If something right could be so wrong Carry on cause I know I have to let you go I know it's bad to take a leap Into my world of fantasies But we will make it all the way somehow But I know now when I wake up I just have to put my feet back on the ground Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel, At Home with Willowberry. Or if you're new, welcome, I'm so happy to see you all here. My name is Valerie, and in today's video, I'm going to be telling you about how I accidentally set the house on fire, and I have tons of laundry to do, so I hope y'all can stick around and enjoy the video. The very nice fireman said, had I not caught it when I did, the whole house was about to go up in flames. So all I can say is that I'm very thankful that everybody is safe and sound. Nobody was harmed. We're all safe. It's just a little fire damage in the kitchen. A lot of smoke damage throughout the whole house. But it's all going to be taken care of. And let me tell you how it happened. So here's the story of how it almost burned down our house. I got up one morning to make breakfast. And I wanted to make some deep fried pita bread. So I put on a pot of oil. And I went and sat down while I was waiting for the oil to heat up. And while I was sitting down, I fell fast asleep. And I don't know how long I was asleep, but when I woke up, I went running into the kitchen. I found the microwave completely in flames. Um, the cabinets, the microwave, the, the stove, it was just all cinched and burnt and just scorched. But their flames were still coming out of the microwave. So I grabbed the fire extinguisher and was able to put the fire out. And I went upstairs and grabbed the family. And we came downstairs and called 911. And they came out and made sure that everything was fine, made sure the fire was completely out and that we were safe to stay in the house, which we were. So I'm just very thankful that nobody was hurt. Everybody was safe and sound. It's just that we have some major repairs that we're going to have to do now before we can sell the house. So, and while I was making this video and thinking to myself, oh my word, how am I going to clean all this smoke damage? How am I going to get up on that ceiling and get it clean and... Just everything that has to be done. All the thoughts going through my mind. And my husband calls me and he was like, Well, the insurance company called and they're sending a company out who's going to do the cleaning. So that there's actually somebody who's going to come out who's going to clean all the smoke damage, do all the repairs. We're not going to have to do anything. So I, I had already started cleaning in this video. So I'm gonna, I did finish sweeping and mopping and just got a few things cleaned up. But we got a company coming in that's going to do a top to bottom clean for us. And then another company is going to come in and do um, painting and repairing, you know, replacing the appliances and things like that. So I'm just, like I said, thankful that everybody was safe and sound and that everything's going to be taken care of. I think that I'm going to hiding Somewhere by a gated star Baby, they ain't never gonna find me I'm a renegade oh. I could be the one who saved you from this harm play We could be as one and we'll escape We could run away, we don't gotta stay
Some gates never get to open cause it's too late I could be the one who saves you from this place Baby, they ain't never gonna find me Find me, find me We could run away, we don't gotta stay I can feel it if Well, y'all, I feel like I've done all I can do in the kitchen for now, so I'm going to head off to the laundromat. I think I've got maybe 20 loads of laundry I need to wash. I've got pillows, blankets, rugs, curtains, our clothes, everything, you name it. Everything that got smoke damaged, I need to wash. So let's head on off to the laundromat.
want you to leave so I can get you off my mind. Well, that about wraps it up for today's video. I just want to say thank you for being here and watching my video and supporting me. And I hope that you would hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. And do me a favor. Before you go to bed tonight, make sure you give your loved ones a hug and a kiss and tell them you love them. Because you just never know what might happen. So, I'm just very thankful that nothing happened to my family and that we were safe and sound and that the fire wasn't worse than what it could have been. So, I hope everybody has a blessed day. I'll see y'all around on my next video. I'll see you later. Bye. I'll be okay.